Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome. So today I just have some meatloaf for gravy, mashed potatoes and gravy, and some buttery corn. And I have some fruit punch Tahitian treat. Yeah. I made this um, meatloaf yesterday. And I was gonna make a video, but I got tired. Yeah, this is so good. So basically, I'll tell you how I made it in a minute, but the gravy is not homemade. It's kind of homemade, but it's not. It's the, um, the packets. Mm. So I bought the gravy packets from Aldi's, the um, brown gravy. But I did add seasoning and stuff. And then plus with the, the cooking and the meat, it got more flavor. Mm, it tastes homemade though. Mm -hmm. Am I the only one who really like TV dinner corn? I feel like they got the best corn. So basically what I did to mimic it is I took some frozen corn <laughs> And I put it, I put it in here. I poured some out and put it in here. And I just, I didn't add no water. So, cause you know, it's frozen. So it got the water in it already. And I added some, some parquet. I just squirted some parquet on it with a little bit of salt. And I um, put some, uh, what's that called? Saran wrap over it. And I microwaved it for like maybe three minutes. And it tastes exactly like seaweed in a corn. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. No, this is really good. I made the meatloaf. Mm. I don't know if I can see. I think I'm gonna get a um. I think I'm gonna end up getting a Canon, Canon M50, I believe. So I need, I've been using my phone this whole time. I need a camera. Cause sometimes the quality of the video is not really that great to me. And it's around, I believe six to $700. Mm. I was going to get the Sony. I don't remember the now. I don't remember the rest of it, but it was a Sony camera, and it was almost two thousand dollars. I said, "No, nah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start off small and get the Canon, and then I might upgrade later on." That's my channel to grow. Why well, ever upgrade? But you know, it's my channel to grow. I'm upgraded. Hmm. Hold on just a second. Ooh. I got sensitive teeth. I should have got a straw. But okay, the way I made the meatloaf is I took, I believe it was a little bit over a pound of ground beef. I took ground chicken. Two eggs, I mixed milk and water with a little bit of um, uh, beef flavoring. I just mixed that. That's probably, I used like a third of a cup of a combined, not each, but I used a third of a cup combined. <laughs> mixed it. I didn't heat it up. I just mixed it until it dissolved. And 
then I took um, half a cup of panko crumbs. You can use bread crumbs. You can use crackers. Whatever, you know, however you make your meatloaf. And I took pepper, um, garlic powder, um, two packs of French onion, two packs of French onion seasoning, I believe. And I just mixed that all up. And it was kind of soft, so I put it in the refrigerator for like 30 minutes just to get it a little bit more cold so I left the meat out of room temperature and I put it in the pan I greased the pan oh also I put two squirts of parquet um, butter in there you can use oil or butter whatever you want just because the chicken is not that fatty so I added a little bit more grease uh, fat to it um, Cook it at 400 for an hour covered, and then you know as it's covered, it's gonna kind of steam, so it get moist on the inside. But the outside would be like pale, so I took that off and cooked it for an additional, I think, 10 to 15 minutes. And then I sliced it and mixed the gravy powder. You can make your gravy however you want, and I poured that on there, and I baked it for about 20 minutes. And it came out like it was more gravy, but we ate yesterday, so this all the gravy that's left. And I baked it like that, and that's how it came out. Mm -mm. I'm glad I caught it. This is really good. I do not really care for meatloaf because I really hate that meatloaf that got like the the red ketchup stuff on it. I do not like that. So my mom used to make it for me with the Campbell soup mushroom gravy. It's really good. So how's everybody doing today? Mm. Mm, this is so good. I haven't had corn in a long, long, long time. Corn was the vegetable, it was my favorite, but broccoli is my favorite. Mm -hmm. yeah, this is really good. I should make more gravy. And Pete Meatloaf, what's your favorite? sauce to go on it or you originally with just a um, ketchup I mean don't get me wrong it's it's good but I don't really like ketchup like that and then I don't like sweet beef if that makes sense I mean, besides like honey ribs with like barbecue sauce. And also, I mix mine because I mix mine with the chicken. Because it gives it a more softer texture and it's not so hamburgery. I don't know if you can really tell, but it's more of a softer texture. 
Not like in the middle of your mouth. And potatoes, I don't eat I don't eat homemade mashed potatoes. I don't don't yeah, I don't cut for me. It's just the texture is not my favorite. Like I don't like chunky mashed potatoes. And the texture is more so gritty. And with box mashed potatoes, I feel like it's more smoother. And what I did was just basically I bought some, well, I didn't boil the milk. I made the milk come to a simmer. I added some butter. I added the mashed potatoes. I added wrench, wrench seasoning, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, and a little bit of salt. I didn't add much salt because the gravy on here, and then I added the ranch season and salt. And I added some chives. And that's pretty much it. <laughs> um, I will eventually start doing more recipe videos. I know people um avoiding that. But I have an iPhone and my iPhone only takes so much memory and I had to delete I believe three videos that I did recipes for because why well, I didn't delete I just didn't upload it because I have enough memory. I deleted one of them. <laughs> so once I get on the camera I would make more um, recipe videos, and I also want I want a green screen. Like behind this, it's it's some material that's like this, but it's green, but it don't really work. Like it would make my if I try to do a green screen, it would make my make me look gray or something, and it don't really work. I don't know why. Maybe I'm not setting it up right. I don't know. I'm getting full. I don't even want to eat this other one. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to get the, uh, it's a green screen on Amazon. That's a hundred and thirty. $5. I'm going to get that. And basically what it is, so I don't have to keep taking this down whenever I want a green screen. It's a thing where you can just push up and down. I'm going to get that. That way. I want to use a green screen when I'm um, traveling or if if I'm um, doing regular talking book lines. But if I'm doing ASMR, I'm not using a green screen. I didn't use black. And just to switch it up. Mm. Yeah. I'm not going to eat that right now. Eat it later. I'm full. So, I know somebody suggested, um, uh, what is it, a giant king crab seafood boil, yeah, I am going to do it, but, I'm going to do it, but it's like, I want the sounds that was out. I went back to Sam's and they had, I don't know if it's the right one, but it's like a, a leg and a claw together and it's like, I think it's 60 or 50 some dollars. Is that expensive? That's expensive to me. I don't know. 
I might just do um, snow crab legs until my channel get a little bit bigger so I can get more um, revenue, more money, so I can end up doing, you know, better foods or more expensive foods. So, yeah. But I am going to do cream crab legs. Might be one or two, and I throw in some shrimps or something like that. But I'm gonna do cream crab legs, and also, I'm gonna start my below sauce for my last seafood boil. Still in the freezer, so I'm sorry to prepare. And I know, I know y'all want me to do more taco videos. I will be doing that. So I see that's um, like a favorite on my channel, taco videos. And I haven't done pizza in a while. So maybe I'll do pizza. Um, chicken. Even though chicken, wings, legs, breast, whatever, is my favorite. They don't really do that well. They do well, but... Not as well as my taco and my pizza videos. Or like something that's like cheesy. But yeah, make sure you guys like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.